What's going on? It's your boy, Waldo McMillan, a.k.a. Dank Potato. And today, I'd like to show you how to make a cake. Maybe you got a birthday or something like that coming up on here on uh, Project Zomboid, or maybe you just want some cake. So, I'm going to show you how to do it. Okay, first, if you have some cake batter, that'll make things a lot easier. But if you don't, let me show you how to make it. You're going to need to find this magazine right here and read it because it allows you to make the cake better. Either that or you can uh, have an occupation as being a chef and you'll know how to make it. So those are your two options. This is everything that you're going to need. So you're going to need a bowl, yeast, some type of spoon or something, flour, butter, sugar, eggs, and milk. And notice how it says two eggs and two flour. After you have made the batter, you're going to need a baking pan so you can pour it into there. Once the baking pan is ready to go, you can make um, the cake with up to four different items. Like four, four any items that you want. But for this example, we're going to make a fruit cake. <laughs> this part of the video is going to be like a walkthrough. So I can just show you how to do everything. So you grab your bowl and your spoon. Grab all your ingredients, make sure you have uh, two eggs, you know, all your all your ingredients. Then what you're going to want to do is uh, you'll click on the bowl, scroll down to make cake batter, and you make it. Boom. And so, as you see, you still have some leftover things. You know, you used your eggs, and for some reason you still have two flour. I don't know why it says you need two flour, but then you still have two flour, so I, I don't know. Maybe that's a little off, but... After you do that though, you uh, would grab your baking pan, then you're going to click on that and you put the cake batter into the pan. And there you go. Now you have cake preparation. And once you have that, then you can put uh, your four whatever ingredients that you want in there. So we're going to put some strawberry in there, we'll put some, uh, we'll put some pineapple in there, we'll put peach in there, and we'll put some grapes in there. And then when you put all this in there, you just simply click on the cake preparation, scroll down, and you can put your ingredients in there. And you have to put them in there one by one, but... Now you can't put anything else in there after you've put up to four ingredients in there. And as long as you have like a working stove in your house, you can just throw that bad boy right in there. If you don't, then you could uh, use a campfire or you could use one of those antique ovens and throw some wood in there. Now you want to stare very intensely at the stove as you wait patiently for your cake. Make sure you grab your cake before it burns. Now you can hurry up and eat your cake before um, a bunch of zombies come at you like a bunch of hungry fat chicks. Just a joke. Don't get all mad. It is what it is. But if you enjoyed the video, if you like it, if you found it somewhat useful, you could always leave a comment. You could leave a like. And if you want to see some other type of tip or trick or something, let me know in the comments. And I'll try to do my best making a video or something on it. Also, if you don't know what to say, you could always say potatoes. And uh, thank you for watching all the way to the end. Have a blessed day.